What's going on YouTube, GSNOR here. So in today's video, we're talking about what you should do right now in terms of updating. Should you stay on iOS 17.5, 17.0, 17.3, or should you update to 17.5.1? Well, I would definitely advise you to update it. I'm going to tell you about why in this video. So this video is brought to you by Technosure Reboot, a software that allows you to repair your device if it's stuck in the boot loop or it's no longer booting, if it's stuck in recovery mode and stuff like that. Definitely check the program out in the link below. A free trial is available for both Windows and Mac OS. So you probably know that iOS 17.5 does patch a lot of vulnerabilities, which means iOS 17.4.1 and lower should definitely be good for jailbreak purposes. Well, if you're not interested in jailbreaking, and I actually want to make it clear, this is for people who are not interested in jailbreaking, you should definitely update to iOS 17.5.1. There's a huge bug that was patched. This is actually quite big for Apple because they usually tend to market their iOS and iPhone as being one of the most secure on the market. Well, it turns out that there is a bug in iOS 17.5 and possibly even older that can actually make old deleted photos resurface even after you sold the device. It did actually happen to some people on Reddit and that's how we knew about this bug and Apple quickly fixed it in 17.5.1 after it became basically headlines in all major news publications. So what happens is that, well, you would wipe the device, you would want to sell it to somebody, for example, but then your old photos would start appearing on that device after it was sold so they can see your old photo. So Apple finally fixed this and we do now have iOS 17.5.1 signed with 17.5 not signed anymore, as you can see from here. And this is actually quite important you should update the bug is a pretty huge one and even if you're not planning to sell your device the simple fact that random photos you deleted years ago start reappearing on your device in the gallery could be a major privacy risk so I definitely advise to go ahead and update. Now, if you are interested in jailbreaking, you shouldn't update, which of course leaves you exposed to this bug and to this issue, but there's not much you can do, I'm afraid. If you want to jailbreak, you should stay as low as possible, preferably below iOS 17.4. Now, if you don't care about jailbreaking at all and you would rather have the privacy, go ahead, do update. I'm going to assume you're going to be the judge of that, so you decide whether you update or not and what matters more to you or not, but you should know that iOS below 17.5.1 has a huge, huge, massive privacy risk, especially if you sell the device. So thank you for watching. I am Geosnow. Till the next time, subscribe and stay updated. Peace out.